she thinks she's on America's Next Top Model. She's auditioning to make sure that when you do decide that you want that woman, you already done seen her in her best glory, what she could do. That's how women move, very stealthily. So you might be thinking, okay, as a friend, she gonna present as such, but the whole time she's trying to let you know, I'm here for you, boo. Like that's- For real. Them women, with, the, with these women that y'all have in y'all friend zone and their female orbit, the sex is still on the table. No. Keep it real. Wait. Hold on, Seth no, no. Still no, on the I, no, wait, wait, can I, can I, I, I believe that, I, I believe that women will stay around. Like women might want sex with that man. I feel they like women not might even want it. Sex can with I that answer man, that? That man is not attracted to her, or if he well, has Israel a needed to answer that, though. Can I answer that? Israel, answer it. All right, Israel, go ahead, answer real quick. They might not even want the sex. So, no. Sex, if, listen, and and maybe I'm different, but for me, if I don't want to have sex with you, I'm not gonna have sex with you. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if it, it doesn't matter what you want, if I don't want to have sex with you, like, no, it's not on the table. Period. That don't mean she don't. That don't mean she don't want it though. It don't I matter don't. though. What, what does it matter? Whether, whether yeah, she wants it or not. I get it, but let me just not, we come out with right, the we, we want Leah, it or not. Let go, Leah. Go ahead and let go. Respond. That don't mean. Women are like water. We know how to mold and confirm into any situation. And if if sex was on the table before and you take it off, unfortunately, a lot of us, our hearts is attached to our vaginas. So even though you took it off the table, in her mind, if she's feeding you emotionally, if she's there for you and you are the one that the shoulder to lean on, you can become the dick to sit on. But she is thinking at some point that it could get back to that point. And guess what she's doing the whole time? You, you're thinking that you're just friends. She thinks she's on America's Next Top Model. She's auditioning to make sure that when you do decide that you want that woman, you already done seen her in her best glory, what she could do. That's how women move, very stealthily. So you might be thinking, okay, as a friend, she gonna present as such, but the whole time she's trying to let you know, I'm here for you, boo. Like that's, that's how I go a lot of times, I'm telling you. Especially I since you know, before. But we're not talking about the woman's intention. We're talking about the man's intention. The question is, why do men keep women around and it doesn't have anything to do with sex? So just like Israel said, I have access to beautiful women, all right? I don't have to have sex with all of them because they are assets. So if I'm sleeping with a woman and it doesn't turn into something, right? Or I don't want it to turn into something, or she doesn't want it to turn into something, that relationship is going to be somewhat all over the place because emotions are there or whatever. So we could be like this one time and then we'd be like, it's, it's a lot, right? Because it's emotional. How, how is she an asset? asset? How is she an asset? Hold on, wait, hold, hold on, on wait, I'm, I'm gonna tell you. So when it comes to not having sex with a woman, she remains a consistent asset to me because I'm not having sex with her because I know if I do, shit is going to be all over the damn place. You know what I'm how, saying? How right? is she an asset? Okay, so um, just as a content creation standpoint, I do content with only women. Y'all barely ever see me do content with dudes because I like women. I don't really care about doing shows with dudes. I, I don't want to do that. So virtually every time you see me doing a show with another person, it's going to be with a woman because I love being around women, talking to women, having conversations with women. So even if I wasn't doing content, I was still, or I did still have female friends when I sold cars. I had all kinds of women friends and I wasn't on social media. So it wasn't just about social media, but that's one of the ways she can be an asset. You call a woman, be like, yo, what you think about this? Just like Israel said, it's so many different things. Women are assets, but it's oh. sad how you women are the main main ones who don't think y'all are assets. But that shit is not. So basically, can I add this real quick? Can I add this real quick? Can I add this real quick? Let's go Israel and then die. Go ahead. All right. Yo, just real fast. So this this is it, right? So there's so many different things. Like, like let's just say you're a club promoter and then you have lots of bad female friends. You're going to uh, work with those bad female friends and you're going to get them to get their male friends and dudes that like them to come in the club and they're going to pay. They're going to try to impress them. They're going to pop bottles, whatever. So they're getting bread and you're <laughs> getting bread by working with them and leveraging their assets. Now, as well, this is the thing. If you sleep with those women, 
then they you do. mess that up. No matter how good it is, no matter how bad it is, you mm. lose because one, like you said, ninety percent of the time. 95% of the time, her emotions and her heart is connected to her vagina. So yep. uh, I got some you, pushback on that. Wait, oh. hold on. So when you cross those oh, lines, yeah, push back. when you cross those lines, then it like like uh Miss Leko say it convolutes things and makes things messy. Yeah, now so, she's so a lot of times if you're able to be disciplined and you don't even look at it like that, but y'all are cool, you keep your, your female friends, your female friends, and you don't put now. Now, this is another thing. I'm not saying that y'all are going out to eat candlelight dinners and y'all are sitting at the crib one one on one and she's in your room and stuff like that. Hell no. You can't like as a dude, if you like women, you can't do no shit like that. So what you do is you just keep them at arm's length and y'all handle business and y'all be cool. Y'all might chop it up on the phone or y'all might chop it up in groups and stuff like that. But you don't put yourself in no compromising position. So right, still, right, still on the time. On. Let's, get, let's get Lady Di. <laughs> no, Lady Di. Lady Di. Lady Di. So I don't know why you brought a, a club promoter into this. That's their job. All right. So they're going to get all pretty women to come to their table so they can get more people to come to the table and do their job. So that's different. But it seems like you guys have women around that you... Like you can have sex with, but you in your mind you just like you don't want to. You or you're using an excuse. I don't want to mess it up, so let me not have sex with them. That in your head, if you could, you would. No, <laughs> yeah, that is not true. Wait, wait, hold on, stop, stop. I need to address that because the question said, why do some men sometimes keep women around that they don't see a future with? So what I'm saying is that you can have these women around, but your intention is never to have sex with them at all. So no, you but you said, but you said, and the reason right. is right. why because right. you right. like to support. Right. 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 And let me go after Bruiser. Right. 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 So, Bruiser, then Sweeney. Bruiser, go ahead. But first, you said, you said the reason why you have these women around is because you have too many options. I mean, you have other people you're having sex with. I'm telling you, that's cap because you can't have sex these, with all oh, of them. Hold on, let me finish what I'm saying. When you got the opportunity, if you if, if a man find anyone attractive and he got an opportunity to have sex with him, it don't it don't matter how many options he got. It's all about opportunity and availability. If she's available and you got the opportunity to have sex with her, and she's somebody that you actually would have sex with, you're gonna have sex with her when you're given the time. That's an it's, 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 you're a and loser secondly, or and secondly, when you talk what? about and secondly, when you talk about assets, it's actually the other way around. Whenever you're a man and you have you're using women for, for as assets as leverage to, to get you more money, it's actually better if you actually have sex with those women and actually serve their emotional needs. Because what? once let me finish. Because what? once because once she get a boyfriend on the side that's doing that, she's gonna go wherever the D at. You're wrong. I, I'm, hold on, let me let me make this last point. If the you're D wrong. if she got a boyfriend on the side and the D is good, and the D is good. And he say, hey, look, I want you to stop hanging around Mr. Lego. That's it. No, Bruiser. it's not. Listen, hold on. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> oh, See, my that's God. Th this is, wait, that's no, true. that, no, no, hold on, 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 hold on. Wait, wait, uh, trigger Mike, can I please push back? Please push back. Uh, push back just quickly, then we got to get the right, this queenie, then we going to put this to bed. This is a mistake that most, back in there too. This that shit mistake that most dudes make. Yes, like Liz said, a woman's vagina is often connected to her heart. However, if you have a relationship with that woman, when you have her mind in her heart, it oh, supersedes God. all the D in the world. And Fact. that's what most men do not understand. No, when you have no, a woman cap. mind, no, that's cap. her man can make her stop messing with you. That's a fact. Her man can make her stop messing with you. Thank you. Thank you, Leah. Listen to him. This is important. You should listen to a woman on this part. No, I've never listened to women about women. Are you crazy? One mic. All right. I've never listened to women about women. Ever. Sweeney, go ahead, push back. And uh Leah, we're gonna let you get the last word. I gotta put this one to bed. We got other topics. Hold on, man. I gotta say one last thing out of Leah. Out of Leah. Go ahead. First and foremost, you just pretty much torpedoed your own argument when you said if you can't go into a room by yourself with it because xyz might happen that literally just proved my point where i That's said sex I said. is always on the table you ain't got no woman around you that sex isn't on the table just for the hell of it 
unless y'all are already friends, just friends first. This this question is like asking true. a situation where you go out and just be friends with somebody. When, of course, like women, true, of course women. Of course, women. Of course, women can be friends to men and all of that, and we can have those type of conversations and stuff. This question doesn't ask that. It said, besides sex, why do men keep women around that they do not see a future with? That is a romantic type situation. 